Hello, Maddie. How you doing? Um, it's a crazy time that we're living in, and I'm. Uh, this is where I've been spending a lot of my time doing my e-learning uh, through this COVID-19 situation that we're in. So I've been doing a lot of um, uh, a lot of online stuff. I've been posting, this, uh, taking videos, and posting it to YouTube. Doing a lot of skyping, and so it's a wholly different world. And I'm guessing you're doing some of the same thing uh, at Purdue. So let me get on to your um, essay, your personal narrative. So I'm, uh, I'm going to cover this the same way that I would uh, when I had you in class in that uh, I'll make just kind of some general comments here. One, so I like the way that you, that you went from a personal kind of narrative and then you uh, link that into going beyond you and to figuring out what was, um, you know, what's your inspiration for going into the field that you're going into. So I, I noticed that you said that you wanted to uh, narrow down the number of characters to uh, 5,000. And there's ways of doing that. I know I get to rambling on when I write something. And if you, you cut out the crap out of there, uh, the, the unnecessary uh, words, then it's probably it's going to be an easy task to do. So you do mention lateral mobility. I'm not exactly sure what that was at this point. I have an idea, you know, in, in terms of... Um, moving through the economic culture um, horizontally, I think, is a, in terms of, uh, as, a, as opposed to vertical mobility. So I, I think that's what you mean, but I'm not quite sure. I do think you mentioned that down below. The other part here um, is um, kind of a technical thing. Uh, aside from learning alongside a local doctor and providing medical access in undeserved communities, I think this is about you. So you need to have a subject there. So I changed this around. I immersed myself in a completely different culture and lived like a local for a week. Dash, it was an invaluable learning experience. Okay, so I think that's the way you want to go there. And then here's one of those examples of, do you really need all of these words? And so this is an easy way of cutting down on your characters. So I intend to carry mission trips into my career as I envision aiding medically underserved populations. And then the rest of it's fine. I mean, you, you tell a story and you tell it smoothly and it's, uh, it's well done. And to tell you the truth, I forget what year, <laughs> I lose track, I forget what year you happen to be in at Purdue, but um, uh, I know, I'm sure they have served you well. And I hope that in the future that um, if you ever need any help like this again, that you keep me in mind because I'd be more than willing to help you out. You're a good kid, and I do miss seeing you. Bye.